So it's been a little while since we did a watch update. That's not really true, is it? We did one not that long ago, Adam. You seem to be buying watches non-stop. I'm done. I'm not buying any more watches. I said that last time and the time before and the time before, but I'm addicted. There's not much you can do about it, right? Anyway, so I got some new ones and I got some that I think I've never shown you. So here we go. And your lens is dirty. Does it matter? Yeah, I've got a cloth. I got a t-shirt. <laughs> there you go. Better? Yeah, yeah much better. Yeah, it's taking that big glob of bird poop on it. <laughs> <laughs> Perfect. Okay, so should we start? Let's do it. So this, very, very cool. It's a Jacob & Co. Why do you have a pocket watch? In case I want to put it in my pocket. I mean, you but need a big pocket. Is that cool or what? I didn't know Jacob made pocket watches. Well, it does more than that. Watch, there's a button on the back here. You press this and then this comes out. You take the chain off it and it becomes a desk clock. Oh. It's definitely interesting, isn't it? Yeah. How many times have you had it out of the box since you've owned it? The day I got it and today. <laughs> That's why I don't think I've ever shown it in a video. I don't wear suits. So a suit would have like the little pocket in it and I don't know, but how cool is it? It's very, I mean, I, I had no idea Jacob made pocket watches. Isn't that beautiful? And it's got diamonds around the bezel. Diamonds around the inside. It's, yeah, it's very interesting. Yeah, and then all the markings are inside this. So you can see what it has to say for itself. Huh. But yeah, so there it is. You should send it to one of those companies that turn them into wristwatches. That would be a me <laughs> meaty wristwatch, wouldn't it? Wouldn't it? But it's pretty, isn't it? And how much do they go for? I bought this such a long time ago. I don't remember. I think like 108 or 110,000. Wow. That was four or five years ago. Wow, okay. I have no idea what it goes for now. But, and what um, complications does it have? Does it do the date or is it just time? Just the time and full skeletonized. Okay. And the, the diamond bezel is inside the glass. That's kind of cool. Yeah, that is awesome. And then obviously everything is solid gold. Everything is solid including gold. Including the chain itself. Yeah, and it's very heavy. I normally say feel it, but I didn't, but it's very heavy. So, sorry to interrupt the video, but this is important. We are in Malibu, California. We've just filmed the most amazing mega mansion. Amazing. So you've got to check that out. If you're not subscribed, make sure you do, but that's not why I'm interrupting. I got you the most amazing deal with the new Tsar Bomber watch, which has got features that I've never seen before. Ready for this? Check this out. These are the straps and are you ready? This is the watch. It's a Japanese movement, high, high, high quality and you can do whatever you want. Unlimited customization features. For example, you put a red carbon bezel on it and then you go and you pick the strap. Let's put a white strap on it. It literally has a button on the back. It clicks in, boom, done. How about this, Adam? That is amazing. And I know what you're like with matching your outfits to your watches. So now you can really dial them in. Yeah, not only that, you can actually change the crown to any color you want. So it matches the bezel. You can put red on here, yellow, change everything. So yeah, PM25, go check it out. All the information will be in the description. It's very affordable. I never seen anything like this. I'm showing you this. I've never shown this before. I went to school with a child whose book bag folder thing looked very similar to that. Yeah, this is a bit bit manked up. It looks like a bit. my first watch collection. <laughs> so this is what put Jacob on the planet, right? As really? far as watches, yeah. This was one of the very, very first Jacob & Co watches he ever had. Is that cool? Don't lie, don't say yes, it's not. <laughs> but it's fun, isn't it? This is the five time zone watch and it's not running its quartz, so it, clearly it needs a battery. But this is a complete set, which is, I would imagine in this day and age, very difficult to come by. And I've had this forever and never shown it, never worn it, but it's where Jacob first started. That's so interesting. Look at the difference. I know. Come a long way, right? I mean, to go from making quartz, essentially just like costume jewelry, to then making this, serious timepieces. This is diamonds. Right, but I, okay, yeah, so I didn't necessarily mean that there wasn't real diamonds, but in terms of the watch itself, five time zone, which sounds impressive, but then it's quartz, which just means that there's five watches. And I can't read this, but is that numbered? No. What does that say? Los Angeles, Paris, New York, Tokyo, number 159. Ah, there you go. So it's number 159, so a very early one. 
And then they came out with a round one. Well, wasn't there that one that the all of the celebrities were wearing? Yes. You could change. Was it the bezel? The you bezel. Could you could unscrew the bezel. This one is permanent, so. But you can yeah, change the strap. You can change the straps. They just clip in, I guess. I've never. Do you still have that. your uh, digital Jacob with the? Uh, I do. Interchangeable bezel. Yes. You haven't, you haven't worn that for ages. I know. There's a reason. <laughs> it's, it's, not, it's not my favourite, but yeah. So there it is. I'll and do you, how away. much were they when they came out? Which one? That one. I don't know. I think I think a couple of thousand dollars. Maybe right. no, we more than that. Diamonds, maybe five thousand, six thousand. Okay. And do you know what they're worth now? Can't imagine this is worth very much. No. I mean, two, no. three thousand dollars. Okay. Not but even maybe, as like. Maybe as a complete set like this, it might be somebody might like their multicolored case. Me. <laughs> it does. It looks like it looks, a, looks like a, like a school case, book right? bag. <laughs> okay. Let's get on to. Let's get on Should to. Should we? I, You've got them out, they're all yeah, here. I got, I got, Do you want I, to I talk about yes, them? Yes, please. May I? Okay, yes. May I? Okay. So this is my new one. This is AM. PM for the evening, AM for the day. And this is just amazing. It's exclusively available retail in Harrods in London and also online. So we'll put a link in the, in the uh, description. There's a code PM10 for 10% off for the launch. And it smells divine. Shall I spray it? No, not in here. No, it'll never go away. It lasts forever. <laughs> it, lasts, it lasts forever. And then if somebody wants to go crazy, these are the Swarovski crystal bottles. How crazy are these? That's nuts. And are they, obviously they cost a lot a extra. Lot. A lot. These are, I think, four or $5,000 a bottle. No, they are well, not. Well, they're all hand done. It's Swarovski crystals, Swarovski crystals, and each one is hand chosen, they're all different sizes, and it's immaculate, you don't see any glue, anything, I don't know how it's done, but it's brilliant. <laughs> so yeah, there you go, if you want to spend a ton of money to smell, smell the same, <laughs> smell buy like this. Michael. <laughs> yeah, right. Oh, that's hilarious. But, but this is so popular, Harrods love it, it's best seller, and it's, this one won all the reviews last year. So what can I tell you? I have this thing for fragrance. Should we do some watches? Yeah, let's do some watches. Okay. Ready? Ready. I mean, well, let's not show them all at once. Okay. <laughs> How about this guy? So this is my second Constantine Shaken. This is the Minions. Although the time is set correctly, I'm going to show you how it works. So this is the minutes. What are you laughing at? It's just and this is such the, a funny uh, watch. I know, look at this watch. <laughs> look at that. <laughs> What time would that be? That would be... Quarter to three. Yeah. And the tongue is the um, part of the month, the, what do you call it? The moon phase. Oh, but yeah. It's not really a moon phase because it's a tongue. So it's the tongue phase. <laughs> but this is so cool. And the, the strap is made of, it's leather, but it has some kind of a jeans fabric on top of it. It's denim, right? Denim, yeah. So it's denim, and then it, but it has leather on the inside. Leather on the inside, yeah. Oh, okay. Leather on the inside. That's so funny. And so these are actually licensed, so... Yeah, these minions. are officially made by Konstantin Chaikin, um, who is Russian. Incredibly, uh, in, what's the word I'm looking for? Uh, innovative watchmaker, makes all sorts of fun complications, and this is one of them. That's amazing, because you have the Joker, don't you? The one that I looks like the, a clown. I have the clown. So that he makes the clown and the Joker. Oh, okay. So uh, I have the, the clown, which is a piece unique, and then this one, which is uh, 38 pieces of this watch. Fun, right? That's so funny. Oops, he just decided to uh -oh. turn himself over. Does he have a name? Do you know which minion he is? I didn't know that minions had names. Of course, there's Kevin. Uh, yeah, let's call him Kevin. There you go. Hi, <laughs> Kevin. That's the Kevin's uncomfortable. Shall I put him on here? No, let's let's leave him uncomfortable. <laughs> He's got that funny face, right? <laughs> Stay there, Kevin. The list on these watches, it's about, I think, 14,000 euros. Uh, so $16,000. Online, there's only one that's available that I've seen on Corona 24, and they're asking $44,000 for it. 44? Yeah. Wow. 44. That's an expensive minion. Yeah. Stop peeking. Okay. Here's another fun watch. You haven't seen this one before. Just got into this brand and it's very, very cool. This is a Chrono Swiss and this is the Candy. And these illuminate at night in their various different colors under, under black light, looks spectacular. 
th that's obviously the hour, this is the minute, and then this, let's get it going, is the second hand, and watch what happens when it gets to 30. Oh, it's a flyback. Flyback, yeah. Ah, I like those. I do too. Bing. Bing. Oh, that's fun. Isn't that fun? And then the back of it has a purple rotor. Very cool watch. It's a big watch, 44 millimeter. I think it's 44 millimeter. Can I show you something else that's very cool before I get to the next watch? Yeah. Ready? That. Check your, this out. Your speaker? Is this the speaker? No, this is the coolest watch winder oh. you've ever, ever seen. So let's take one off. They clip onto the stand. And I'm going to show you how this works. It's very, very clever. By far the best winder I have ever seen. Totally silent. There's no sound whatsoever. And via an app, you can program the actual watch that you have to the winder so it knows exactly how many times it needs to be rotated and all sorts of fun features. Oh, wow. Uh, and it comes in single, double, triple, stand, all sorts of combinations. In fact, we'll put a link in the uh, description for this as well because I was so impressed with this. I actually called the manufacturer. Uh, it's Time Machine, Time Machine Winders. And uh, I spoke to the CEO, who's an amazing guy, very, very smart guy. And he wanted to develop the best winder that's ever been made. So uh, he developed these. So, so, so clever. Uh, so I got a deal for us as well. So, <laughs> of course. Yeah, why not, right? A big deal. These are not inexpensive, but they're worth it. Uh, the deal we have is 30% off. Oh, with, wow. with, it's a big, big discount with yeah. the code PM30. So yeah, so let me show you how it works. It's so cool. These come in different configurations, different sizes. Mm -hmm. so oh, that's you, fun. So, so like spring-loaded. Yes, yeah, so if you put a watch on it, let me do this. Oops. Okay, and then if I pop this in. Is it clicked in? Yeah. It automatically knows there's a watch in there. Ah. Oh and it will start winding. Now this watch is not set for this winder, I'm just doing that as a, as a demo. But you can do it all through your phone and this is just a touch on the top. Did you see that? Yeah, the little button, yeah. Yeah, so you can change it, uh, the, the settings to how long you hold it down. Uh, just ingenious. I mean, it is silent. I Totally silent. Totally, totally silent. Yeah, that's totally incredible. Silent. There's no vibration whatsoever. It's very heavy. Is it? Feel the weight of it. Oh, I don't want to grab it. Oh, wow. Oh, my God. Very heavy. Yeah. Very what heavy. It, it Solid feels like it's aluminum. Made of, oh, okay. I was going to say, yeah, it feels like steel. Yeah. So I'm going to put that there. I have probably 25 different winders. I rephrase that. I had 20 odd winders. They're all noisy. They're all clumpy. They're, they're useless. And I don't know why I just like the look of this. It's stunning. Yeah. It's brilliant. And the packaging, when you see it, I, I, I sound like a salesperson for this company, but when you see these, the way they come and the way it's packaged and the way it's made, it's mind blowing. Yeah, I mean, they are beautiful. Do they yeah. come in different colors or are they all black? I think they're all black. There's yeah. different configurations. Works you don't have me. to buy the, the stand. Oh, okay. But, but um, anyway. Very nice. Watches. Okay, but oh, look. Did you break your chair? I think I did. I bought this about- Three four, months ago. Five, six weeks ago. It was when we went to Happy Jewelers, right? Yeah, it was when I did my trading. Yeah, yeah. I'm building my collection, so with yeah. things that I'd wear. You know, I don't have one of these. Oh, this is really cool. Great every day. day. Too. So it's Very a little bit larger. Comfortable. It really suits you. That's yeah. nice. Yeah. How much is this? I like that. It's still brand new. Never, ever, ever been worn, but I think I might wear it today. It is the Yachtmaster. And it's just a very classy, beautiful, simple watch. Yeah, I really like that, especially on the Oyster Flex as well. Kind of dresses it down a little bit. Right? Yeah. Nice watch. Yeah, very nice. And I think, I know you're going to ask me how much is it? Um, I don't know. I, no? th I think 37, 38,000 is the, the list. And I believe you can get these around list now. They're, they've uh, become available. Nice. Oh, we didn't say how much your uh, Constantin Shaken was. No, not Constantin, this one, your uh, Swiss Chrono. Oh, this guy? Yeah. Oh, that's a good question. Um, <laughs> I think like 14,000. 
So when you buy these, do you check the price or do you just go add to basket and then? Well, unless it's going to be one of those outrageously expensive ones, uh -huh. I, I just add to basket. But if it's outrageously expensive, I negotiate the heck out of them. <laughs> right. try to. You can't do that anymore with you know, the Pateks and Rolexes and APs because they've, they've just gone crazy. What about RMs? Don't talk to me about RMs. <laughs> you, know my, you know my thoughts on RMs. Okay, don't look in the box. Two, there's two APs, everyone. There's two APs. So I wore this in a video, but never shown it. Beautiful watch. This is the summer, summer edition. edition. Yeah. yeah. Rose gold, 44 millimeter. Stunning, right? It's a gorgeous watch. And you know what's funny is somehow, even though that is a absolute monster of a watch, it looks relatively, I don't want to say dainty, that's the wrong word, but it, it looks much lighter than it is. Feel the weight and then tell me if it's dainty. <laughs> That's what I mean. It weighs a ton. There's nothing dainty about that's this. That's so it's heavy. It's like half a pound or yeah. something. Yeah. But, but that's what I mean. It doesn't look like if that was stainless steel on a stainless steel bracelet, if that was black, it would look big and bulky. Somehow it doesn't. No, I think it's it's elegant. Yeah. Right? It's, the white, the rose gold. I love the, the, the rose gold pushes as well. Yeah, because usually they're black or some different. Are you impressed with my watch knowledge now? You have come a long way, Adam. I know. A long way. And look what I'm back to wearing. Apple Watch. You know, every week I tell myself I'm going to buy an Apple Watch. And then every time I go to Apple to buy an Apple Watch, I tell myself I'll need my glasses to read it. So I do. <laughs> but I should get one anyway, right? That I really like it. It's taken me a while and I did wear it on my right wrist, but it can't read through tattoos very well. So it kept locking on me. So I just- What do you mean it can't read through tattoos? So it has the sensor and the sensor- It knows if you have a tattoo? It can't, yeah, because it reads, it, it basically puts green light through your skin to get to like your blood and everything else. And that's also how it does the locking. So that's how it knows whose wrist it's on. And because I have my tattoos, it won't read through them very well, even with this little sticker trick that people talk about. So, do you regret getting the tattoos? Absolutely not, but I have taken to wearing on my left wrist, but I know that my days are numbered and I will eventually just sell it because I'm gonna get them on my left as well, so. All the way down to your hand? All the way down, yeah. Are you gonna do your neck? Yeah, and my toes, and my face. Let's move on. <laughs> okay. How much? Oh. Um... How much? Uh, I think the list is about 55,000 uh, or 60,000 and they are selling now for about 90 grand. You can't get really? that watch. It's a limited edition. How many of them were there? I can't read it. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. This is the brand new one. The ceramic case with the rose gold and I think this is gorgeous. I really do think this is gorgeous. It's exactly the same size as this but the contrast between them is huge. So which, one, which one do you prefer? The summer, for sure, this one. See, I would have thought you would have gone for the black one. I know. Because it's pretty. It, it is, it's lovely, but the, I really, really like this watch. There's just something about it that I really like, and I'm not even a rose gold person. Yeah, this one, this one is very, very pretty also, though. I mean, very, very pretty. Don't you think? Yeah, I do. And actually, do you know what's funny is even after I said that the, the white somehow makes it look more dainty, if you hold these up next to each other for me, the because of the black dial, it actually makes that one look smaller case-wise. Does the it? Ca well, what it is, because the case on this, you see it all the way to the top and then you get the contrast, whereas this one, you more just focus on the bezel and the dial, this actually looks bigger than this. This one's a lot heavier. This one, it's still heavy, but it's nowhere near as heavy right. as the all gold one. For sure. But there we have it. No, two lovely watches. And then I'm done. You've seen that one before. What? You can't just leave it in there. It just happened to be in the box. What is it? It's that funny watch I bought from Seth. Martin Braun. Oh, yeah, yeah. I don't know why I bought it. I've never worn it, ever. And you were so infatuated with I'm it I'm still well. infatuated, but I'll never wear it. Ever. I love the dial. Mother of Pearl. Yeah. I don't know what those two needles do. Something to do with the weather or the equator or something. Is it like, you know, how you get those people that can find water underground with those two sticks? That like, yeah, exactly. Is that yeah. what that does? Yeah, that's exactly what It'll that does. It'll help you find an underground well. And then what are you wearing? My Langer striking hour crazy watch. I forget how to make it strike. Oh, I think you press this. You have to listen. Oh, wait. Yeah, Where's the microphone? Down. Yeah. yeah. Ready? That wasn't it. 
That was it. I don't know how to make it go double time. It does it by itself. No, I'm changing the time. No, I'm not. It just happened to change it. I don't know, but look at the back of it. Lovely piece, right? Gorgeous. I really like that. Yeah, very nice. I do appreciate the complications like the striking hour, the uh, the flyback. Like it's cool. It's different. You know, right. everyone everyone's got to watch that tells the time. Everyone's got to watch that tells the date. Correct. So those things are really cool. So this. I do know what it does, I just don't want to overpress it because I, I don't know how sensitive it, it is. He doesn't but know what it does. Everybody, he doesn't, what he doesn't know what it does. He it on and off. And when it gets to the hour, it goes ding. And when it goes to the quarter hour, it goes ding dong. <laughs> so it's like ding dong. <laughs> does it do seconds? Is that something else? Yeah, it does seconds. It has seconds. So what's and the second sound? If we've got ding, oh, it doesn't ding do, dong. It doesn't make noise. Tick tock. <laughs> tick tock, tick tock, tick tock. And then it has this, which it says, I don't know what it says. Oh, AM and PM. Does that say AM and PM? It's, it's they've even got your fragrances on here? I was about here? to say. Oh my goodness me. Is buy it, now from producemichael.com. Is that what it says? Yeah, it does say So, AMPM. So here's the thing. Go buy these, buy one of these, and then you have the set. <laughs> and then buy a watch winder to wind it with. And then buy a watch winder. This is so cool. This is so cool. I like that. So there it is, guys. I am done. I am not buying any more watches ever again. Mm -hmm. Completely finished mm -hmm. until the next one I buy. <laughs> Do you think I will? 100%. Of course you will. I'm sick of buying watches. We're going to see Seth this afternoon. I'm sure you'll see something there. <sighs> well, that's it, guys. So go shopping. Um, link will be for the winder. Best winder ever, ever, ever. Link will be for Producer Michael Fragrance. Best fragrance ever. What else can I say is the best, Adam? Um, beautiful day outside, best weather ever. We're done. Hit the like button, hit the share button. We're in it to win it. See ya. Oh, and subscribe. Oh, and subscribe. Yeah, make sure you subscribe and tell all your friends, tell all your enemies, tell everybody to subscribe and your pets. Now I'm going. Bye.